Hey guys, it's Erica. Welcome back to my channel for another plan with me. I'm using a kit from Shop Jessica Hearts, which I have never used a kit from her shop before. Um, so this was like completely new to me using her format and everything. And with the way I've been planning lately, I definitely had to change it back to the way I used to plan. Um, also, I forgot to mention, but you can see here, I am planning for the week of September 30th through October 6th. Um, I decided not to use any bougie boxes or any um, full box overlays or even glitter header overlays. I'm opting out by using the Sadie Stickers um, bow headers instead. And if you can see my watch tan line, which I know you can, it's literally right on the screen. Um, it's really bad. I The past couple days, I've been having so many difficulties with my watch not connecting. Like, neither of my watches will connect to my phone for some reason. So I've just been, like, not wearing them. But I finally got it all figured out and all that. So you don't have to see my horrible tan line anymore. Um, but like I said, since this kit is called Simplicity, I thought... Why not just go back to the way I used to plan where it's just super simple with no bougie boxes, header overlays, um, full box overlay, overlays or anything like that. Um, and I kind of like really miss it. And in the end, I'm like, you know what? I'm saving money doing this because I don't have to buy so many dang bougie boxes. But I just love the bougie boxes. Um, but I do like the way it turned out. So I'm perfectly okay if I don't have any glitter or um, foil everywhere in my spreads so I don't know we'll see it was a good change for a little while but I might go back to my bougie boxes but we'll we'll see next week I still haven't planned the following week yet um in my sidebar I am tracking what I've been tracking the past few weeks which is my water intake and vitamins along with my dinners and then in that Sadie stickers half box I put it on the sidebar I'm marking that it was the first week of hockey and the sharks home opener so first thing on Monday, um, I am using a sticker from the Fox and Pip to mark that I worked at a preschool, which I usually don't, and now I know I never want to work in preschool again. Um, I love my school age kids, and I just I could not do it. I, you just can't hold a conversation with them, and yeah, it's cute, but not when you're working with them for a long period of time. At least for me, I just know what I like, and so I've learned that I definitely like school age. Um, I also went to Subway on my lunch break and then I took a nap after work. Um, also after that I went and drove to Sacramento to go visit my boyfriend and we went to Trader Joe's which he's never been to Trader Joe's before. Um, so it was his first time there and I picked up a couple things to meal prep and that meal prep sticker is from GP Sticker Studio and then we also watched some Breaking Bad later on that night. And then I think I write everything down. Oh, I'm using a pen from um, Shop Villa Beautiful, which I don't like using her pens on the planner paper itself, which you can see because it just skips a whole bunch. I don't know if it's the way I'm writing or how I'm holding the pen or something, but I always have problems with her pens. But honestly, it's really not just her pens. It's a lot of, lot, just a lot of pens in general. My pens always skip. And I don't know why, but it's always me. Um, but it works perfectly fine on the stickers itself, just not on the planner paper. Um, moving on to Tuesday, I actually had the morning off, so I slept in a little bit and we just had some cuddle time. And that paper or that sticker is from Paper Shire. We also went to brunch at Estelle's. Um, it had, I think we had like a ham sandwich and tomato soup. Tomato soup was good. The ham sandwich definitely like made us sick. It didn't sit really well with us. I also went and did some stuff with Dean to go support him and some things I don't want to write in my planner. And I even told him, like, I would not write it in my planner what we did. But I know what we did in there. So I just put, I went there to go support him. And then I drove home to go to work later that afternoon. And I had a really bad migraine after work. And so I just passed out early that night. I actually went to bed at, like, 6 30 because I got off at 6 so I passed out at 6 30 and then the next day on Wednesday the first thing I mark is that I got 12 hours of sleep like my head was killing me my, actually, my head was actually killing me that whole entire week but um I slept 12 hours straight just because of how much pain I was in and I just I apparently needed to catch up on my sleep so I used a coffee monsters co little emoji to mark that I also had to go work back at the preschool again they've been really short staffed lately so um I worked there Monday and Wednesday 
and that was my last day and I'm never going to do it again. I made that very clear. Um, also we had a meeting this day, which was a meeting for like preschool. So I don't even know why we went. My supervisor is mad that we went because she was told it wasn't going to be about preschool. It's going to be about school age material, but it was definitely a preschool material. And so it was kind of a waste of my time. Um, but after that, I went and got Chick-fil-A because I was so hungry and Wednesday was like the busiest day ever. It was nonstop all day. Um, I also changed my sheets and did laundry and that sticker is from GP Sticker Studio and I did a face mask which I've been using my drunk elephant face mask that like $100 face mask but I absolutely love it and I really do notice a difference so I recommend a drunk elephant. I love drunk elephant. That's like literally all I've been using for like every day products um so anyway yeah I did that and then also this was the day that Shane Dawson came out with part one of his Jeffree Star collab and uh, I just love it so much and I've been so into Jeffree Star lately I know before I started watching any of Shane's stuff on Jeffree's on like when he did collabs with Jeffree Star I never honestly liked Jeffree Star I just thought he was too much for me but after I started watching this first episode, I was like, you know what? I'm going to go back and watch his previous one that he did last year with him. And I'm like so into Jeffree Star right now. And I've been watching all of his videos and I don't know. So I'm really obsessed with the documentary and just everything about them too. And then I also um, door dashed some Buffalo Wild Wings or no, I didn't. My boyfriend door dashed me Buffalo Wild Wings that night because he had a hockey game late at night. So he um, door dashed that for us. And then moving on to Thursday, we had our licensing visit finally. We were supposed to have it back in March, and they just never came. And so we've always been on edge because they could literally come any day to our center to just do a licensing visit. And they came bright and early at 7, 10 a.m. And it couldn't have gone better because we only had two kids, and it literally was not stressful. And it was just like the perfect timing. So we finally had our licensing visit, and we don't have to worry about it until – next year because they come at least once a year so they can't come again until after September 3rd so that's when I can start stressing until they finally come again but I was so happy they did that I also had a lash lift that day um and I love it I absolutely love my lash lift I have super long lashes and thick lashes to begin with but they grow straight down so I'm so happy I got my lash lift it just I I just love them. And then I also had a kombucha once I got home and I did a YouTube binge. And I also binged some Grey's Anatomy this night. Um, and I think I mentioned this before. I just started rewatching them all. Um, I also got a bunch of happy mail from the Coffee Monsters Co. Glam Planner. And I got my Quip toothbrush um, head in that day. So that's what I marked down below with that Fox and Cactus little happy mail girl. Moving on to Friday, we had another meeting. Um, I think this was... Oh yeah, we just had a super short meeting in the morning. I actually had the day off, but I really had to go to that meeting. So I woke up early to do that. Um, when I came home from the meeting, I did some organizing of my stickers. And I filmed a haul, but I did not mark it because I didn't have room for it. Um, but I went ahead and, we, and I filmed a haul and organized all my stickers. I also... Um, this was the day that was the Sharks home opener. So me and my boyfriend went to a subway before we went on our little road trip to San Jose to go watch the Sharks game, which they lost pretty badly. I don't – it was just an ugly game. It was really ugly. Um, and then I also had a Sharks roll. They had these, like, specials. Um, I'm pretty sure not just because it was the home opener. I think they're going to have them all season. But they had this Sharks roll, which it didn't have shark in it, but the rice was dyed teal blue, which was really cool. And it was really, really good. It reminded me of a roll that I get from my local – sushi restaurant that I love and so I wanted to mark that we had our sharks roll and then we ended up coming home that night as well. Um, Saturday I I woke up super early. I was able to sleep on the way home from San Jose. My boyfriend's the one that drove and so he was super tired so I got to sleep on the way home and right when we got home too. So I got to wake up early and I had my morning coffee and this is the day I got to kind of enjoy myself outside for a couple hours with my dogs. Um, and then I also did a whole bunch of filming, um, that day too, because he was literally just like sleeping all day. And I'm like, you know what? I'm at my house. I can kind of just do whatever I want. I have all my stickers with me. I'm just going to go ahead and film a whole bunch. So I filmed a lot. Um, and I marked that with a script from Letters to Apollo, which I think, 
I think this this is my last script I have, so I need to purchase more of my film plan with me's. Um, so that is on my list of things to buy. I also did a Grey's Anatomy binge, and then this night was um, my best friend and her husband's ready, wedding reception. They got married last year, but they never had like a party for it, so I went to that. Um, my boyfriend had to work, so I had to go alone. Um, we also had just a, a great talk that night too, and then when we came home, we just door dashed some more dinner because we didn't feel like cooking, and we got cheesecake. And I don't think I got anything. I know he was hungry because he didn't go to the party. But at the wedding reception, they had the best street tacos ever. They had like a taco truck or taco cart guy come. And oh, they were so good. So I had four of those. Um, so I wasn't really hungry. But we still got some Cheesecake Factory for us to eat later. Um, last day on Sunday, I drove down to SAC super early in the morning. And we just kind of had like a chill day. We went to brunch. We went to this place called Magpie, which it was the only thing that wasn't busy because I guess this Sunday, usually it is busy. I'm not going to lie on Sunday brunch days. But for some reason, the wait was like going to be an hour and a half. And I'm like, I am hungry now. So we went to this place called Magpie, which we're both not really fans of. It's kind of super expensive and you don't get a lot of food and the food's not amazing. So I don't recommend it if you're in Sacramento. Don't go to Magpie. Um, and then I also had my haul go live this day. I think this day I did a lot of editing. Oh yeah, I did some editing too this day at his house on my laptop, which I never do. I use my iMac to edit videos, but it worked pretty well because I factory restarted my laptop, so I might start doing that. And his internet was super fast. It took 20 minutes to upload rather than taking hours and hours to upload at my house. Um, we also went and got some coffee at Temple because they just opened one kind of closer to him so we just walked over there and temple is my favorite coffee place i don't know if you guys remember but back when i was in college um when i would fill my plan with me's i always marked that i went to temple because it was so close to my college and i just i love that place um i also oh yeah this day i think actually the day before shane came out with his part two of the documentary but this was the day i watched it um, I didn't have time when it first came out and I'm pretty sure it didn't come out on the 6th. Um, so this was the day I watched that. And then we both drove back home because I didn't have my car and I needed to go home because I had to work the next day. And so, um, we drove back home and we had some yard house happy hour, which we have not gone to yard house in a long time together. I think the week before I went with my best friend, but, um, both of us, we hadn't gone in a while. And then, um, we just kind of hung out we had to go charge his tesla and so we just sat around at yard house and enjoyed ourselves for a little bit had some good pasta i always get the um lobster garlic noodles those are my favorite and we always get the chicken nachos because those are the bomb um but yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and finish filling this out um that pretty much completes this week's plan with me Love the way it turned out. There are a couple stickers here and there that don't quite match because this is a very monochromatic kit. Um, but I really wanted to use those stickers, so I just I had to use them. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put the date cover or the date dots in soon too, but I did not forget those. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and also thank you guys so much for subscribing and just keeping up with my plan with me's and follow me on Instagram and stuff. I really appreciate it. If you're not following me already, go check it out because you can see close-ups of this spread. Um, my Instagram handle is Erica Marie Plans. Um, don't forget to like this video if you guys enjoyed it. Leave a comment down below if you guys have any questions. Um, other than that, I will see you guys in my next plan with me. All right, bye guys.